this is Stani, so I'm going to get right into this reading. This is going to be a Divine Masculine Energy Check-In because it's been crazy. So, as many of you know, the Lion's Gate is really pushing unions. Um, the Lion's Gate Energy is all about unions and twin flames coming together. So, this is really coming to a head August 8th. Then you have all this fire energy, Leo season action energy okay and we're going into a full moon as well so a lot of manifestations are going to start to come together so um i feel like there's been purging and there's been like a call to action like i feel like without the cards i feel like the divine masculine has been having dreams thoughts and just yearning so basically divine femme you know how you were like wanting to chase and all this stuff so basically the chaser energy has flipped okay so the divine masculine is now in the chaser energy now masculine energy is always supposed to chase okay the divine masculine emperor energy it's in their nature okay so that's why you cannot contact or initiate contact or chase divine from if a man or masculine energy you know some of you are dealing with women with masculine energy um masculine energy it's in their nature to go after what they want if they really want to talk to you if they really want to be with you they are going to be with you so this leo energy is crazy nothing stops leo energy okay so a lot of you have been getting communication um a lot of you have been getting like weird communication a lot of you are meeting up okay i've been talking to some of you and a lot of you are like literally meeting up with your um divine masculine a lot of you you haven't heard from them forever and then like they've come out of the blue so this energy is crazy so i'm gonna get right into it and a lot of purging has been going on as well so let's see what is the divine masculine thinking about so basically this is going to be um a look into the divine masculine's mind their heart and the action space if you want a personal reading as this is a general reading all messages aren't going to resonate then my information is below all right so don't try to make it fit if it's not resonating it's not your reading plain and simple okay so if i don't need to hear comments oh this is not gonna happen or oh you're right or oh they, they're still with the karmic then this isn't your collective okay so i keep it real i'm from new york and all you guys know that so wow the divine masculine wants to put work into this situation like i said the divine masculine wants to make efforts okay the dm i'm gonna say he just so you won't get confused so even if you're dealing with a woman i'm saying he it's masculine energy so he wants to carry you through whatever you're going through basically he wants to help you so the divine masculine is really thinking about like spoiling you taking care of you divine femme i feel like divine femme a lot of you always been having to be independent always having to you know do everything yourself let this divine masculine spoil you okay this is what masculines like to do so this divine masculine wants to buy you something okay so this divine masculine really wants to um show you yeah this divine masculine probably was spying on you so right now in their mind they're trying to figure out what you're doing this keeps coming out the divine masculine is definitely spying on you in this group okay so they could be googling you trying to look you up on social media trying to talk to people that you know uh take the message as it resonates but they are trying to see what you're doing in their mind they're like kind of being immature <laughs> So, yeah, so they're basically where you were before you healed. Um, but, I don't know, Divine Masculine, it's not that they're not healed because this group, they're healed. But this Divine Masculine is very much, like, obsessed. I get an obsessed energy. Um, like, you know, she's mine. I don't want anyone else having her. Like, they're awakened now. And now they don't want anyone else having me. So, <laughs> in the past. This divine masculine is thinking about how they put you in a third party situation. So I want to say 85% of you was in third party situations having to deal with romance. And they're thinking about this and they completely regret <clears throat> my throat chakra. 
has been acting up all day. There's a conversation that's going to be had, and they're going to tell you they are sorry, and they are sorry that they put you in this third-party situation, that they never meant to put you in this third-party situation. So, let's see. Tell me more about the Five of Cups. They're nervous. They're looking at you like you're the queen that you are, divine from. They're looking at you like you don't need them. You're independent, like I said. Successful. You know, you do what you gotta do. Uh, the Queen of Pentacles is like a wife that would like make lunches, have everything taken care of. Um, you know, cater to their man, but they don't have to. The Queen of Pentacles energy is very grounded. A lot of earth energy here. So... This Divine Masculine is like, what did I do? Why did I ever treat her that way? Okay, so this is what the Divine Masculine is thinking. So, what's in the heart space of the Divine Masculine? Let's see. Yeah, like I said, this Divine Masculine knows what they did. And they are feeling kind of like you might not want them. This literally keeps coming out, this energy, even in my personals. This Divine Masculine is worried that you might not um, accept their apology. Wow, because they hurt you. They know they hurt you. But the Ten of Swords, this Divine Masculine knows that they hurt you multiple times and you're tired of it and you're just done and you're not dealing with it no more. And look, here comes the Divine Masculine with a rose. He's like, baby, you're not dreaming. I'm here now, but do you want me? This Divine Masculine is going to take a leap of faith and this Divine Masculine... With the fool's card um they're really thinking about how they have to make this move because they hurt you now they're thinking about all the endings they're thinking about all the pain all the swords that they stabbed in you and you see this is why they're like oh maybe she doesn't want me anymore but they're gonna find their courage and they're not gonna listen to people anymore because before they were listening to people um yeah so action space so this divine masculine they want to have sex with you. That came out real clear. This Divine Masculine wants to have sex with you. You see the panties hanging? This Divine Masculine wants to show you his wand or skills. Take the message as it resonates. Or see your wand if you're a man and you're Divine masculine is a woman um or if you're in same-sex relationships this divine masculine they just they want to be passionate with you okay so they want to be passionate with you and yeah they they feel like that if they have sex with you divine femme for this group all will be forgiven they want to recognize you they want to have a victory with you with the six of wands they want to marry you a lot of passion so the action that they're going to take is has to do with a lot of passion but i feel like this divine masculine is going to like hey how are you and try to get in your pants now that's up to you if you get like a proposal or something but i wouldn't just like jump into bed with this masculine but this masculine i feel like the way they communicate is through sex they feel like oh let me you know make her feel better let me show her that I really, like, am in love with her. But they're going to want to want to take you out. So they want to take you out. They want to woo you and spoil you. And um, you're their empress. And they know this. So they want to nurture you, okay? So also, they want to get you pregnant, some of you. That's what I'm getting. Um, I know this sounds kind of bad, but in the past, they were trapped by someone, I feel, for some of you, whoever this message is resonating for. They cut that situation out. There was a divorce, a separation, but now they want to make sure you're not going anywhere. So there was a death here. And I feel like that has to do with that third-party situation. Um, 
now they want to give you the world and they want to heal this situation but they also they know that you're theirs twin flame energy lovers gemini um they want to get you pregnant for some of you because they feel like you have options so yeah this divine masculine is very focused on the options that you have The sun's going to come out. You guys are going to be running to each other. They're in love with you for this group. They're in love with you. Okay. So, what is the moon energy coming towards this group? I'm going to tell you that they're in love with you. You're getting your wish. You're intuitive. For my divine fam in this collective, you all have gifts. Okay, so you all have psychic abilities. Abundance is coming. Abundance. That means many things. Abundance is not just money. So this divine masculine felt like they had to go on a hunt, basically, and go after all their glory, if you want to say, like, money accolades whatever um they also feel like you know you have it all that's that like queen of pentacles energy something's gonna happen over the full moon they've surrendered but now what's coming towards you divine them this person has surrendered to the connection and they're not gonna fight it no more and they're just gonna come and you know, do what they have to do. So there's going to be a lot of blessings. And this abundance is going to be in all areas. Like, this abundance is going to be abundant in love and money. You're going to see, like, whatever was not going well for this connection, it's going to now go well. So because they're surrendering to the universe, the universe is going to... Um, reward them and the universe is going to bless this union with abundance in money okay so you both are going to have a nice home in this collective and yeah so let's look more into that so what type of abundance is coming in this collective A lot of you have been blocked job-wise. That's going to start opening up. Wow. What did I say? Union. Four of Wands. Freedom. Now this Divine Masculine has the freedom to be with you. And this is Union. Four of Wands. You know, you're seeing 11-11, 1-1-1. -11, union is here. This is the energy that keeps coming out in this collective. So because this Divine Masculine... Um, as I was saying, is going to be accepting this, you know, connection and coming into union. There's a lot of abundance here for you both. The universe is going to bless this union. They're not trying to control the situation anymore. They're not trying to be stubborn. They're not trying to have everything go their way. King of Swords again. So this Divine Masculine definitely lately cut somebody out and now they're going to come speak to you and they're going to speak their logical truth you can be dealing with air signs a lot of air earth and water okay and the passion is a lot of fire so i see all elements here but um i see predominantly earth air and water so you or your Divine Masculine can have a lot of air, earth, and water in your chart. This Divine Masculine is going to really, like, sit down with you, Divine Femme. Like, you've been wanting that apology. They're going to apologize. They're going to lay everything out on the table and be like, this is what it is. This is what I did. And yeah. So overall, what is this Divine Masculine going to offer you in the near future? 
this is not months and energy this is like now energy so I feel for many of you this is happening within the next two weeks to two months within the next two days for some of you but definitely communication and unions so if this isn't happening this isn't your collective it's safe for you to love they're gonna make effort this is the message you're gonna make the effort now overall okay so there's a separation so for this collective a lot of you are still in separation you spend a lot of time apart I feel like you've been apart a long time not just like weeks okay not just months but you guys haven't spent quality time together from a year to two years even three years or more this divine masculine is going to now show you that they're a different person and they're going to show you changes because they know that great love is worth taking the steps okay they they know that and they're being guided all right so that is what they're going to do action energy they're going to make you know steps towards you so i hope you enjoyed your reading bye